Hi everyone, so today I finally have my Amazon eBay brush video for you guys. I have tried um, most of them and I'm just going to show you up close what they look like and what you can use them for. So most of the brushes that I bought are from the Amazon and they are called the Tonsi branded ones and I feel like they're Zoeva dupes. But I bought a ton from them and I absolutely love them. The quality is amazing, they don't shed, you can wash them fine. Like literally they're so good for the price and I definitely recommend them and I will show you each and every one of them and what you can use them for. Um, it's only the MAC eBay one, I think they're a bit like, and plus I think they were pricier than the Tonsi ones so they were, they were alright but not as good. Like the Tonsi ones are really really good, like they're definitely Zoeva dupes. So yeah, if you guys want to see these brushes then keep on watching. The first set that I got are these... Uh, mac dupes i would say that are from ebay you have like three white ones and i don't know if there's a difference in their fur but um to be honest like my two favorites are these two so let me talk about these ones so this one if you look at it it kind of has like a nice fluffy tip um they do shed a bit more i find but this one is really good for blending this one does feel a bit more dense but it's nevertheless still good like it's really nice in the crease um, it works really well. These are what the MAC brushes look like and to be honest, it's, they're quite, they're quite, they do shed a lot. That's what I have to say about them. They do shed, um, but nevertheless, they're, they can't harm, I, if I would, it wouldn't be the one I would recommend out of all the sets I'm going to show you, but I will still use them. These are definitely my two favourite ones right here, the two fluffy ones. These are not my fave and I probably won't use them as much but for the price I guess they were okay but they're not my fave. So I've tried my best to keep all the brushes together but this one is like one of my favourites and I do have quite a few like Tonsi sets but this one's really good because you get like your fan brush which I really like. It's a bit like thin but it does the job really well I think. And you also get this kind of cool, um, I would say, it's this one's really good to just brush your under eye baking, this is what I use it for. And then um, you can also set like your base colour on your lid. This one is just a classic blending brush which you could use in your crease or on the lower lash line. This one's really good because it's like that flat shader brush that you can use on your lower lash line. Or even just set like your brow bone with a light colour. This one's a more denser and shorter fluffy brush, but this is something I would use if I'm doing a cut crease and I want to deepen the crease or if you want to like um, smoke out your lower lash line. This one is kind of like your flat shader brush. I would use this only on my brow bone or to smoke out my lower lash line. This one's kind of a cute brush, but you could use this for your liner or also on the side of your nose, which I've tried it for, which is okay. Um, if you want to contour your nose with it, it's really good. This is more of your like classic lid brush. If you want to pack on colour on your lid, this one is a really good one. It's quite flat. And then I would say you've got your two liner brushes. This one's quite a peculiar one. This one is quite dense, so you could use it to really pack colour right close to the lash line. And you can use them for your brows for anything really your liner so yeah this one is definitely my favorite set like it's so good and so affordable and they look so pretty like i definitely feel like they've gotten inspiration from zoeva brushes like these are definitely zoeva brushes dupes so these ones are quite dirty because i used them yesterday and i haven't washed them but um, they are good, like it's not my favourite, but there are some brushes that I really like, like this one. This one is really good to just set your, your whole lid. I also like to blend my concealer on my lid as well with this one. This one's another favourite of mine, it's like perfect to blend out your colour in the crease. This one is really good because it's a bit thinner, it's still a fluffy brush. The only thing is I find them quite long, I just wish that they were a bit short in length, like the bristles. But this is really good, like I've been using it to deepen up my crease for a cut crease. This is like your typical flat, super thin brush. This is really good to carve out your brows or you do a cut crease with. This one I've actually been using to set my brow bone with. It's kind of like just a flat shader brush. 
this one is more of like a wide angle flat synthetic brush i would call it um and this is really good to just pack on color on the lid that's what i've been using it for but it's so large that you can still use it for like concealer or just to carve out your brows with this again is a kind of like flat fluffy brush and i've used this in my crease um it's not too thick though it's quite thin actually but you can use it to um, smoke out your lower lash line as well here you have like a fluffy brush this is a really nice one for the crease and i like this pencil brush um, to go right close into my lash line or like highlight my inner corner i haven't really used this liner brush but I don't, I don't necessarily like brushes like this, so I haven't used it. Um, you do have like an angled brush, but I find it quite thick. Like it's not very precise or thin, so I haven't really used this much. And then this is really good to like smoke out your lash line with. It's really nice. And then finally, I did get like a dusty pink set. They're really, really, really pretty. Like seriously, and the, just the handles are very good quality. They feel very sturdy. They don't feel cheap, even though they are very cheap. <laughs> and they do come from China. But um, this has been very used. Again, I haven't washed it. I'm really sorry. But again, like this one, the liner brush, I haven't used because I don't like these type of brushes. Um, I have been using this to... Um, set my brow bone with this is quite like a fluffy shader brush you've also got your angled brush i haven't used this one but you can use it for anything like to brush powder in your brows um this is a really 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 nice brush i really like this one because it's not too long it's quite short and it's nice and fluffy so it just it's just perfect to just blend color in your crease or wherever really <laughs> i have been using this one so much i've been using it to carve my cut crease out with and carve my brows up because it's so thin like it's really dirty right now but this brush is so thin and precise like it's a, one of the best brushes in this set you've also got like a little tiny pencil brush i've used it to do like my one of my eid looks with and it's really really good this is my one of my favorite fluffy brushes out of all the sets because it's nice and short it's not too long and it blends like a dream and it's nice and soft and fluffy you also have like a just a regular fluffy shader brush you can do anything with this really you also have a nice i would say i would call this kind of brush a concealer brush but i like to use it to carve my brows or just pack color on my lid and then finally you have a little shader brush that i use to pack some eyeshadow in my crease it's very nice and fluffy and quite short so it's not too long like the others so that is this set and as you can tell like they're so cute and they're such good quality and seriously for the price you can't go wrong with these so that's the end of this video guys i hope you enjoyed it if you want me to do more ebay amazon tries let me know i could even try like different type of products from ebay like lip products and things like that um let me know if you want to see stuff like that from me and thank you so much for watching i love you guys and i'll see you next time bye